welcome in this video i am going to solve two questions the first question is find the lcm of 12 and 15 and the second question is find the lcm of 7 and 8 so first i am going to find the lcm of 12 and 15 so 12 comma 15 now here I will keep on dividing 12 and 15 by the prime numbers till I convert both 12 and 15 to 1. So I will keep on dividing 12 and 15 by the prime numbers till I convert both of them to 1. The smallest prime number is 2 and 12 is divisible by 2. So I will write 2 over here. Now 12 divided by 2 is 6. 15 divided by 2. Now 15 is not divisible by 2. So I will write 15 as it is. Now 6 is divisible by 2. So I will write 2 over here. 6 divided by 2 is 3 and 15 divided by 2 15 is not divisible by 2 so i will write 15 as it is now 3 is not divisible by 2 and 15 is also not divisible by 2 so the next prime number after 2 is 3 now 3 is divisible by 3 so i will write 3 over here now 3 divided by 3 is 1 15 divided by 3 is 5 now if you look at what we have got you will see that i have converted 12 to 1 12 have been converted to 1 by dividing it with prime numbers so this task is finished now i have to convert 5 to 1 i will keep on dividing 5 by the prime numbers till i convert 5 to 1 now 5 is not divisible by 3 the next prime number after 3 is 5 and 5 is divisible by 5 so i will write 5 over here so this one I will write it as it is 5 divided by 5 is 1 and now if you look at what we have got we have converted both 12 and 15 to 1 by dividing it with prime numbers so the task is complete so the LCM of 12 and 15 is you just multiply the numbers over here so it is 2 into 2 into 3 into 5 and what is this 2 to the 4 4 3 is a 12 12 into 5 is 60 so the lcm of 12 and 15 is 60 so 60 is the answer for question number 1 the LCM of 12 and 15 is 60. Now let us do question number 2. Find the LCM of 7 and 8. So 7 comma 8. Now here I will keep on dividing 7 and 8 by the prime numbers till I convert both 7 and 8 to 1. So I will keep on dividing 7 and 8 by the prime numbers till I convert both of them to 1. Now 2 is the smallest prime number and 8 is divisible by 2. So I will write 2 over here. Now 7 divided by 2. 7 is not divisible by 2. So I will write 7 as it is. 8 divided by 2 is 4. 
now 4 is divisible by 2 so i will write 2 over here 7 divided by 2 7 is not divisible by 2 so i will write 7 as it is 4 divided by 2 is 2 now 2 is divisible by 2 so i will write 2 over here 7 divided by 2 7 is not divisible by 2 so 7 i will write it as it is 2 divided by 2 is 1 now if you look at what we have got i have converted 8 to 1 so 8 has been converted to 1 by dividing it with prime numbers so this task is finished now i have to convert 7 to 1 by dividing it with prime numbers so i will keep on dividing 7 by the prime numbers till i convert 7 to 1 now 7 is not divisible by 2 the next prime number after 2 is 3 now 7 is not divisible by 3 the next prime number after 3 is 5 7 is not divisible by 5 the next prime number after 5 is 7 7 is divisible by 7 so i will write 7 over here now 7 divided by 7 is 1 and this one i will write it as it is over here and now if you look at what we have got we have converted both 7 and 8 to 1 so the task is complete so the lcm of 7 and 8 is you just multiply the numbers over here so it is 2 into 2 into 2 into 7 2 into 2 into 2 into 7 and what is this 2 into 2 is 4 4 into 2 is 8 8 into 7 is 56 so 56 is the answer for question number 2 lcm of 7 and 8 is 56